Hey guys, if you are looking to live stream your pre-recorded video within a couple of minutes, you are at the right place. I'm gonna show you how to do it with live reacting platform, so let's get started. I previously made an account and now I just have to log in. Once I'm logged in, I can choose one of the templates, especially for the pre-recorded live or create a new one from the scratch. But now I'm gonna go for the first option. So I click on one of the templates and now I'm ready to adjust the template in my own way. So first I click on the video layer on the right side, select file and upload the video that I previously recorded. Let's say I have a fitness studio. So I upload the video with a workout tutorial which I want to stream as live. Now, when the video is uploaded, I just click on it and it will appear on the screen. Now I want to upload my own logo, so I just delete this one, click a new layer, click image and select my logo. So I'm just going to place it in the corner, like this. Next, I'm gonna replace the text with my own and adjust the font, text color and the background. As an option, I can add animated text instead of the static one. To add one, I remove the simple text, click new layer, choose text, animated text, and on the right side, I type in my message. Now I'm ready to stream my pre-recorded video. I click settings, make sure that I choose the right account where I want to stream my video. Choose title and video description. Now I have to set the duration of the live stream. I can choose an option to stop my live stream manually and in case it's a video that needs to be streamed longer than 8 hours, I can tick continuous live. Otherwise the stream will be stopped after 8 hours automatically. But this option is not for now, as I want to stream my video for only 45 minutes. So after I chose the duration, I can schedule my live stream for a specific day and time, so it will go out automatically. When everything is set, I just click save button. Now the only thing left is to click go live and my video will be streamed on my Facebook page. This is how my pre-recorded live looks like on Facebook. If needed, I can stop the stream before it actually is supposed to end. To do so, I just go back to my project and click End Stream. And by the way, you don't have to keep your browser open when your pre-recorded video is streamed. You can close all the tabs and even switch off your computer. This won't influence your live stream in any way. We hope this tutorial was helpful and if you have any questions, feel free to ask us in the comments below.